Okay, so recently one of my subscriber asked me this question. Okay, Pramod sir, should we have some kind of a side hustle, which is kind of mandatory nowadays with our safety engineering job that we are doing? And what's your thought on this case? I mean, should we keep some side hustle as a backup? Because right now, if you see, there are a lot of cases where people are getting fired from Facebook, Amazon, Google, multiple MNCs, multinational companies are continuously firing. Recession is going on, right? Should we have some kind of backup or not, right? What's your strategy? In this case, right? I think this is a right time that uh, we should discuss this because job security is very, very crucial nowadays because of the recession, right? So let's get started, and I'm gonna discuss about a couple of important tips, like how I'm managing it, how I'm doing it. It's gonna be a value-packed video. Make sure you stick to the end. You can watch this video in 1.5x so that you can save your time. So first of all, many times we have this question, okay, Pramod, what is the side hustle and everything, right? Side hustle, I think it is something that you can do after your office hours, right? It is not exactly the moonlighting, right? Moonlighting is basically working for a different company totally, right? We are, we are not working for different company. We are working for ourselves, right? We are working on our smaller project, which will definitely help us to monetize in future, which is what we want. Because see, job security is very, very important. I remember this thing, right? Which is recently due to recession, few of my awesome friends, right? They got fired immediately immediately because of recession and all and they were working in very very good MNCs they're working in very good startup those had millions of millions of dollars of funding but they fired after like two months or three months due to recession and all right then when I asked them right if you had some kind of said hustle and if you had some kind of money coming from this right that would change your financial situation right now or not right that's what exactly I asked them right and maximum of them replied yes so it means side hustle is something that every software engineer should do it side by side which is very very one, right. One of my close friend told me that because of the side hustle and because of the smaller freelancing project that I was doing side by side, right, I got fired, but my financial situation is stable right now because of that. Now, see, these are the people who have eight years experience, 10 years experience. Imagine the people who have just started out like four or five years where they also have a loan, right? That job security problem or, or firing or laid off because of the this recession and all, right? How it dangerous can be, right? So this is very, very important. So I think the first point which I wanted to discuss is financial financial stability, right? What I'm doing right now is like, see guys, the most important thing that I have done when I have joined my first company, right? Essentially, immediately, whatever the amount I was getting, for example, suppose I was getting 25,000, right? Immediately 10,000 rupees, I was just saving into my emergency fund because I didn't know that, okay, I may be fired after six months or probably one year, right? I should have a savings of at least six months or eight months, right? This is what I have done it until now I'm doing it, which basically works, right? So I think 20 to 30% saving is very, very important from your, right? I do it more again, it's up to you, which is for your emergency fund, keep it handy. Six months, seven months of that should be, everyone should have it, okay? Second point is everyone, I think uh, my advice will be start something which you really like, but you passionate about after the office hours, right? I know many of you will say that promoter, but right now we have a family, we have a partner, have to give a time, right? But I think everyone can give at least one hour, at least one hour per day or not. On Saturday, Sunday, you can give at least like three hours maximum, right? And you can work on the side hustles, right? It can be a blog that you always wanted to basically create a videos that you wanted to create, right? It can be something freelancing project. You wanted to do it to earn something extra, right? These are things as a side hustle. Definitely you can try. See, my important point is that the side hustle that you basically are doing, right? Why I'm saying it is nowadays a mandatory is it will basically give you a safety net. Whatever happens to you, right? You will have some kind of a safety net with you. You will have emergency fund as well as a smaller amount of chunk of money, which probably will be coming right after office hours and all right. So this will be helpful for you, right? Now question will be, but isn't it illegal to have these kind of things, right? I don't think so. See, if you are doing a minor work, which is not related to the companies, right? Tell the company that, okay, I wanted to do this uh, smaller financial project, right? Which I think out of office are, I'm basically doing, right? So I don't think there will be a problem. I have seen multiple YouTubers plus people who are basically working as a full-time job also. So again, this is a thing which is coming, right? I have seen it multiple. So I don't think so. It, it is too much a problem. If it is a problem, change your company or other things, right? You can try out. All right. So another important point, why I'm saying side hustle is mandatory for your personal growth and satisfaction also. Sometimes, let me tell you a very important scenario. Okay. When I was into a multinational company, right? I was bored as hell. To be honest, this YouTube channel was started because I was bored as hell because of the manual testing. Let me tell you very truth, right? This is, this is the truth that I wanted to discuss. I was a manual tester. I knew that whatever the task for this multinational company that I'm doing, right? It can be done in two hours where I have to give my all eight to nine hours. 
hours right i was pretty much sure if you use automation or some other method right it can be done in less than 2 hours or 1 hour maximum right so i was bored as hell because i have a time right what 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 should i do in that case right so what i have done after the office hours i used to create videos i used to write blogs blogs i have started right? that's why i all started so this is how so side hustle this is how i started then it started generating some amount money and that's how we it basically become a side hustle now right so this is what you need to do also so see overall point if you got anything from this video right i think everyone should have some kind of safety net it can be generated with the side hustle with the emergency fund that you have if you are doing some kind of cyber side freelancing project and all i think that would be great right this is very very important so let me know software engineer should have some kind of side hustle along with the full time job or not let me know your thoughts in the comment below right uh, we can discuss and i definitely want to know your perspective also all right thanks for for joining if you are existing subscriber thanks for for watching this was a quick video around this and if you are a new one i create videos around software testing productivity and software software engineers right thanks a lot i'll see you in the next video bye bye